Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be opening up um, a Pokemon Go Elite Trainer Box. Uh, it's going to be, it's a little bit different. I know my sister opened up a lot of Pokemon Go related products on the channel. Um, but to be quite honest, I ran out of Pokemon products. So I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to open up for this video. And I had this sealed Pokemon Go Elite Trainer Box, and I thought, you know what, let's open it up. Um, I'm actually eager to collect this set myself, so yeah, I figured let's open it up and see what we get. Alright, so I got the box opened. Um, I'm not going to go through the contents of the box. I think we all know what Elite Trainer Boxes have inside, and this isn't really a new product. But I thought this was pretty cool. You know, you get the promo Mewtwo V card. Who doesn't like Mewtwo? So that was pretty cool. Um, and I can't forget the Pokemon Go codes. So there are those. I used to play Pokemon Go all the time. Um, it was actually pretty much right around the time I started this channel that I stopped playing because opening up uh, Pokemon packs and editing videos just took out a lot of time in my day. So I haven't played it in months. But Pokemon Go is a fun game so if you play it there's some codes for you. And then we have this uh, I believe this is for the Pokemon Online game, which is actually being shut down. So, I don't even know what the card trick is here. I think it's still four from the back because it's part of Sword and Shield. So, we're going to hope that it is. Ooh, we got an Ivysaur, Unpheasant, Gamorrupt, Spinarak, Wimpod. Larvitar, Numble, Bulbasaur, and Zip. Okay, I think this might be a Ditto. Um, oh, then we got a Blastoise. Holographic Blastoise, that's pretty cool. Okay, um, I think this is a ditto, and the funny thing is, is my sister tried to get this card for so long, and she finally got it. And here I am, getting it, no, maybe it's not a ditto. Nope, I don't think this is a ditto, never mind. I think this is actually just the actual number card. Okay, that would have been funny. I got it on, you know, if I got it on my first pack and it took my sister how many Pokemon Go products to, you know, actually get the Ditto card. But one of the things I like about this set that, uh, that my sister has pointed out multiple times is... It's a, it's a small set. There's not that many cards. And honestly, they picked like a lot of the good Pokemon to have in a single set. I mean, you got the Legendary Birds, you got Charizard, Venusaur, Blastoise, you got Radiant Charizard, Venusaur, and Blastoise. Um, you got Mewtwo. Like, there's just a lot of really cool Pokemon that they decided to put in this set. See, look, right there's, right there's Zapdos. Now, it's not a holographic. I think it can be. And then we got a holographic Moltres. So we got two legendary birds for the price of one. And that's, that's what I mean. Like, I haven't had, I haven't had the chance to actually collect, you know, original hundred and you know the original 151 Pokemon out of Pokemon packs for a long time and I just hit my camera and so it's like to have to have all those Pokemon in a in a set again 
it's uh you know it's pretty cool it actually makes me wonder if they'll do a follow-up pokemon go set um you know for like Generation 2 and Generation 3. Oh, hey, we got the Dragonite V. So there we go. Our first, uh, I guess that's a full art. I guess that's considered a full art in this set. But yeah, I actually have a ton of, uh, Pokemon Go related products, like Pokemon cards, and I just never had a chance to open them, and uh, now that I ran out of, now that I ran out of Crown Zenith products to open, I figured why not, you know, why not uh, open up some of the Pokemon Go products that I have, so. But like I said, I, I'm I'm actually really excited to start opening this set just because it is a small set. Shouldn't be that difficult to complete it. Hey, we got the Articuno. That's awesome. So actually we just got all we got all the legendary birds, just you know, not a holographic version of Zapdos. I was Contemplating opening up a booster box of Lost Origins because I still have four of those as I hit my camera again. Sorry, I changed my setup here for my camera. And, uh, well, it's not, it works and I like it, but it's not, um, I'm still getting used to the position of it apparently. Sometimes these cards actually, you know. Oh, we got a reverse magic card and ooh, a slacking V. Once, once again, these look like full art cards to me. Maybe that's just how they are, and they're not considered full art, but they look like full art. So that's cool. Yeah, I ran out of I ran out of Crown Zenith, so I, I was I just had no idea what I wanted to do for this video. By the time you see this video, I should have more Crown Zenith. Steelix, it's a shame that Steelix is a diamond. He's such a cool Pokemon. I feel like he deserves to be a star. Spinarak. Pete of Ratata Ratata I don't even know Lore module Ooh, and we got a holographic pussy But Yeah, but yeah, like I said earlier, by the time you're watching this, I should have more Crown Zenith products to open. So hopefully Wednesday, this video will go up on Monday. So hopefully Wednesday, I'll have uh, you know some more products. And I actually have another video filmed from last week, but since last week I had all those Crown Zenith um, products to open, it kind of got shoved off to the background um, so yeah it's just been a pretty oh, okay so we got a reverse Blastoise that's cool hey there we go we got the holographic Zapdos so there you go we have completed the legendary birds out of a single box
Come on, focus, focus. There we go. I am gonna open up those uh, Lost Origin booster boxes though. That is for sure. I just don't know when. And I already know that we have a good card in this pack because I just saw it. <laughs> That first pack that I opened, the cards slid very well. And every pack after that, just not so much. Okay, so we got another Slacking V. We doubled up. I mean, technically we doubled up on Blastoise, but at least it was a different holographic form. that. Alright. Yeah, as I was saying, this set's pretty small. Even including, like, the secret rares and stuff, it's still a really small set. So, you know, it's just, it, it should be a nice, easy set to collect as long as you can get your hands on the products. Ariados, and... Oh, okay, so there's the other Dragonite V. So, yeah, I think that's actually... I think that other one is actually the full art, and this is the standard. I could be wrong. So far, the pull rates, though, for this set are actually really good. I mean, you know, there's not like 200 cards in the set, but I think we got a hit in every single pack. Maybe that's just how it's supposed to be, but still, I, I like the original Pokemon. It brings back uh, childhood memories of collecting cards, so... As I saw my sister opening up a ton of Pokemon Go products, I was just like, man, I gotta, I gotta collect that set too. I gotta do it. Eevee. Okay, so we got our Reverse Snorlax, and I think there's something behind here. Ooh, we got a Conkle, yeah, Conkle Der V. I feel like this might be uh, you know, a special full art card. Not sure. We only have two more packs out of this uh, out of this elite trainer box. Another set that I'm I'm trying to collect is the celebrations set because that's another relatively small set as well. Um, at least I think it is. I have two more elite trainer boxes to open with that set. Um, that set's going to be a little bit difficult because you can really only get packs out of elite tra trainer boxes and collection boxes. But we got a Reverse Steelix, and we got another Blastoise, okay. Alright, last pack. Like I said earlier, I got more Crown Zenith coming, so... Um, We'll be able to get back on track with the current Pokemon set, but figured this set was a nice little, uh, you know, I guess you could say blast from the past. I'm not actually sure how old this set is. It says copyright 2022, so came out in 2022. But, yep, it said, oh, come on. 
All right, we're gonna go like this since these cards don't wanna slide. Oh, sweet, we got the Tyranitar. I think Tyranitar was my favorite Pokemon out of, uh, Wow, I can't remember what what uh, generation he's from. Uh, Gen, he's from Gen Two. Yeah, I think he was my favorite, one of my favorite Pokemon out of Gen Two. But there you have it. I think, uh, as you can see, from like all of the cards that we got, you know, here's some that are just out in the background here that you can't really see, but. Uh, well, here, let's actually zoom out here real quick. So, yeah, there's all the cards. We opened up all the packs. I don't think we got a single pack that didn't have a holographic or better in it. So, maybe that's the way the set's supposed to be. I don't know. But if it is, that's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool set. I would highly recommend uh, trying to collect it if you can. And, um... Yeah, the next video will most likely be a Crown Zenith video, so stick around for that. But thanks for watching this video. Um, yeah, if you liked it, hit the like button. If you want to help us, uh, if you want to help support the channel, feel free to hit the subscribe button. And we will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.